And here we are at the Roddenberry Entertainment booth. Usually we have Rod, but we've, we've, he, Rod mentions them all the time. We've never actually met. Finally, we do. Good to meet you, Trevor Rod. Very nice to meet you as well. Thank you very yeah, much. Yeah, good to see you. Absolutely. So, Rod's actually talked to us a lot when, when he's come on about White Room OTB3. The last, the last time he said it was on hold. Yeah, well, you know, happening. Um, you know, we had to let technology catch up to us a little bit on this one. So, um, you know, it's taken a second, but we're very, very excited to um, launch White Room O2B3. We're actually launching um, an entire entity of our company called Roddenberry 360. Mm -hmm. And Roddenberry 360 is a collaboration between a Roddenberry Entertainment and a fantastic company called Immersive Media, who's best known for like Google Street View. They do yeah. so they're well, really well versed in 360 degree technology. And um, basically, uh, we've teamed up to see if we can't really focus on the creative development, production, and distribution of 360 degree entertainment. Yeah, which actually makes sense because uh, that's when I first heard about it, that, that's what actually come, come and will catch anybody's attention really is the fact that it's not just a movie, it's it's an experience, how you watch the movie. Absolutely. I think that in the spirit of Gene Roddenberry himself and Roddenberry uh, tradition and legacy, we always want to be breaking the mold and it doesn't always have to be what we put on camera, but perhaps even the way we use the camera itself that can be new. And so actually, you know what I'm going to do is I'm going to ask you to put your mic down real quick. Okay. Because I think, I think what best sells everything is the reaction that, that other people have. Because this isn't something you understand that well. So I'm going to just let you put those earphones on real quick. And... Whoa. Okay. All right. So you're going to get to see. Here you go. Just hold it like this. So you're, yep. you know, a lot of people watch you know, movies mm -hmm. um, on their tablets this way, right? Now take a look at this though. So, Put it like that. Here, I'll do this for you. So this is the 360 degree trailer. Take a look around the room. No, take a look around the room. Oh. So this 360 degree technology I mean, literally look around the room. film allows you to completely move your body around and see any part of the room that you want to take a look at. This is obviously a trailer right here, but essentially you're able to watch live footage in 360 degrees and we have created a fantastic story to go along with it. This is the very first science fiction narrative that's ever been done in this way and is revolutionary in regard to the way we not only make certain pieces of entertainment, but consume it. Pretty cool, huh? Talk about being in a movie. Yes. This allows you to literally be in the center of the room while you're watching the movie develop around you. Now this isn't it, but I'm sure you guys have thought of this. Really get interactive. Is that probably what the next step will be? I like think, being a part of the movie? yeah, there's obviously a tremendous number of steps we can take from here. And I think Roddenberry 360 as a as a, an entity is ready to take those steps. Um, to be perfectly honest, you know, people are only ready to take so many steps at one time. So yeah. we wanted to start out with something where people can enjoy it. They can recognize fantastic characters. This particular film that we're launching with, this is the very first Roddenberry 360 uh, offering it all and you know it's got Tamlin Tamita in it it's got Brecken Meyer in it it's got David Blue and Rachel True it's got Tony Janning and Mylon Sarley and uh, you know the great Doug Jones is also in it and um, you know it's something that uh, on August 3rd you will able to go to your iTunes store or your Android market or your Google Play and download it for like only $2.99 by the way. It's not even a lot of money. You download that, you get this entire 360 um, film plus the traditional version plus a featurette that tells you how we made it and a whole bunch of other extras. And it really should allow people to start realizing what Roddenberry 360 as an entity can do because not only do we plan on creating more of our own original content, but we also want to be available to other people who can come to us and say, hey, 
I want to work with you on that. You know yeah. what I mean? There are other networks and studios and producers and directors who we think would be really, really interested in now being able to engage us and saying, hey, I want to add that to my film. I want to utilize that for something I'm doing within my own project. Now get as technical as you want, especially with this audience. Uh, they, got, they got to see a little bit of it. Maybe they didn't get the, the complete sure, effect, yeah. but they're probably wondering, do I have to download something to, to, to make that effect? Or how is that going to work? So on, uh, as, uh, when it's available on August 3rd, you will be able to go to the store and download the app, and the app has everything you need in it. So you don't need to have anything else downloaded. There's no other flash or cameras or anything of that nature that you need. It's all incorporated in this singular White Room O2B3 app. So all you got to do is go search for White Room O2B3, hit the download button, pay your $2.99, and you're off and running. Easy as that. And it's iPhone, Android compatible? Af iPhone, Android, Google, um, cardboard stuff, everything, everything you can think of. Um, it's coming eventually to Oculus Rift and... Uh, Gear VR for Samsung. Yeah, uh, it's not quite there yet, but that'll be following our initial launch. And in addition to that, um, if you go onto the app or onto WhiteRoomO2B3.com, there is a dome locator. Now I don't know if you know this, but there are over 1,700 dome theaters in the uh, in the world. Yeah, and over a thousand of them are in the United States. A dome theater is essentially like a planetarium, often. So the theater itself, the screen is a dome around itself. you. Yeah. Now picture the fact that we just made a 360 degree film that can be projected all the way on every part of that screen where you can sit in the middle and enjoy something happening all the so, way around Unless you. you're thinking that when I was watching this scene, how when you, kind of like, like, a, like a ride, when you go into it, you can actually see a different movie every time. Focus on this character, now this character, That's now this actually, character. The power of the director is in yeah. your hands. You get to decide what you're going to look at. And in a dome theater, you know, I, we recommend people go find their local dome theater. You know, there's a dome theater locator that can go find their local dome theater. Call them up and say, hey, I want this film in my in my theater, so I want to see it this way. Yeah. Because... Be nice about it, though, when you ask. Please. <laughs> be very nice. But um, no, absolutely. You know, people uh, at the, in these theaters want to should need to know. Hey, this is of interest to us. We want to see something new and cool like this. And you know, that way it allows them to enjoy it in that environment. It allows them to enjoy it on their smartphones or on their tablets. You know, there's lots of different ways you can actually consume. In in addition to, by the way, your computer itself that you can consume 360 degree content. Yeah, uh, this is huge. Like I said, this is why I really wanted to see this in action when, when Rod first told us about it. Um, it's keeping you pretty busy, I'm sure, but what, what else is, does uh, Roddenberry Entertainment have going on? Wow, what don't we have going on? <laughs> um, I can tell you that um, you know we continue our tradition of our, of our uh, merchandising business. So if you go to shop.roddenberry.com, we have a new legacy series out. If you love Star Trek and you love Star Trek prop collectibles, it's a great thing to go and take a look at. We have a lot of great things coming out and new things that just uh, are coming back into the store right now. We have our uh, comic books, Days Missing and Worth. Both of those are doing very, very well. Days Missing is actually going to be on its third volume soon. So you can go to Roddenberry.com for those or your local comic book uh, retailer and say, you know, I'd like one of those. All of these things that we're talking about continue to... Uh, contain the spirit of, of Roddenberry. Yeah. They're all pushing the boundaries and exploring human nature and exploring the human condition. If you love Star Trek, you should love something about everything we're doing because it always harkens back to that singular spirit of the human condition, of you know, exploring the experience, of looking for the optimism in situations that are crazy and 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 uh, technological and science fiction fantasy-esque and and that's what we want to do is we want to explore who we are as human beings with the backdrop of science fiction and fantasy as a way to get there and everything we're doing in regard to any property that we have um, is is uh, allowing the audiences to take that trip with us yeah now I haven't talked to Rod about this yet you can you can preview if you want to next year it's kind of a big year for Star Trek it, it, what's going on? What? I think they're going to celebrate a birthday or something like that. Oh, it's like... Maybe you heard about it. I think it's like the 31st birthday or something. Yeah, no, I think so. As you know, yes, next year is the 50th anniversary yeah. of Star Trek. We, um, I yeah, can't you guys talk, have to get involved. I can't talk too much about it, but we have a lot of our sleeves. We're very, very excited about what's going to happen next year. Um, you know, obviously, Star Trek Beyond... 
The new movie's coming out. We're very excited about that. We're excited about um, a lot of things that we're going to be doing at a variety of conventions next year. We're going to be at many, many more conventions. We've got some super big surprises um, that people are going to be, you know, long-term fans that they're going to be really, really excited about. And look, at the end of the day, we want to celebrate Star Trek as 50th anniversary because we love it just like all the fans and we want to celebrate with them and we want to offer things that are going to help them enjoy such a momentous occasion. I mean, it's crazy. 50 years. Who? God, yeah. geez. Who's done that with this big a phenomenon? Nothing. It's crazy. First of its kind. Yeah, I always say it, it came before Star Wars. It did come before Star Wars. We even have it on tape. George Lucas saying <laughs> that, you know, yeah. we needed Star Trek to create Star Wars. So, um, look, all science fiction is great. We are lovers of all science fiction. This one is near and dear to our hearts, and uh, and Star Trek Turning 50 is a big deal for us. So we're going to celebrate in style, and we hope everyone will join us um, in that in that. And we hope everyone will go to uh, you know their local um, you know app store, whichever it is for you, on August 3rd, and download White Room 2B3 and take a look at Roddenberry360.com. At Roddenberry360, it's a, a brand new entity. We're really excited about what it can do. Um, both, again, in the world of original content and with others um, that we're hoping to team up with. No, I never met Gene, obviously. I never got to meet him. But I think it's safe for me to say that just from what I saw there, he'd be proud to see that, that, that his name is attached to something like this. Well, we hope so, and we believe so as well. And I thank you for saying it. It's a tremendous honor to be living his legacy and uh, for people like you to come along and say that we're doing a good job. Yeah, so again, Trevor Roth, CEO of Roddenberry Entertainment. Give the website, social media, all of that where they can follow you guys. All right, so if you want to check us out, you can go to uh, Facebook uh, slash Roddenberry.com. You can go to Roddenberry.com and learn everything you need to know about us. Go to WhiteRoomO2B3.com and check out the app that's coming soon on August 3rd. And uh, Roddenberry360.com. We got dot coms all over the place. <laughs> it's insane. We're crazy. It's Comic-Con. Yeah, Trevor Roth. <laughs> Thanks, Trevor. Thank you very much. Appreciate it.